just finished testing the Stingray 198 LX. It's powered by the Mercruiser 4.3 MPI. And like all Stingrays, this thing gets fantastic performance. We got on plane in 3 seconds to 30 miles an hour in 7.2 seconds with a top speed of 58.0 miles an hour. Now, most 19-footers with that little power, you're talking low, low 50s, maybe mid 50s at most. But they had this boat up to 59 miles an hour with one person a little while ago. And it handles fantastic. We can really crank it in corners beautifully. Let's head back to the dock and check out some of the features. Now Mark, for a 19-footer, I can't believe how much room you have in the back here. This is really neat. Yeah, there's a lot of room on the back of this boat. Um, like you said, for a 19-foot boat, uh, we've tried to maximize the amount of space we have uh, for the sun deck and then the uh, the integrated swim platform. Yeah, it's a really clean look, too. It's uh, Everything just flows on this back end. That's here. right. Like all of our Sport Deck Series boats, uh, We've done a lot to try to make the styling and uh, and use all the features we can uh, tie everything together. Well, I like the fact you don't have to walk over your beautiful upholstery, too. That's true. The, the real walk through is nice. It allows you to board the boat from the back and not, uh, like you say, step on the upholstery. There's also an optional filler cushion if you want to take it full advantage of the uh, of the sun pad there as well. Right. Now tell me about some of the cockpit features here. Um, in the cockpit, we have, of course, uh, full seating across the back with the optional uh, filler. There's also a seat for this uh, cooler in the back. Uh, talking about coolers, there's one cooler aft here, there's another cooler forward. So we've got a couple of coolers on the boat. Got to keep your passengers hydrated for right. sure. You know. Tons of cup holders to go along with the coolers, too. Nice. Uh, Mark, tell me about the helm. What do we have going on? What at the helm? We have full instrumentation. Um, also, you'll notice circuit breakers under each of the switches. What that does is uh, just take some of the aggravation out of boating, not having to worry about fuses. No kidding. So you don't have to hunt underneath there for a fuse. Absolutely. That's my favorite part of boating, for yeah. sure. <laughs> yes. Uh, how about the steering wheel? Yep. Steering wheel's nice. Styling on the steering wheel. Uh, also, we have tilt wheel, optional tilt wheel on this boat. Uh, so, Mark, tell me about the stereo. Uh, stereo, we have Jensen. Jensen Stereo's here uh, with a remote. It's located here. The main head unit is in the dash pocket. Nice. Keep it out of the way. Keep it out, Keep of, it out of the weather, mm -hmm. for sure. Now, what do we have here? Uh, in the floor, we've got uh, a ski storage locker in the floor. Nice place to keep your skis uh, out of the weather and uh, out of the way, out of the way of the boat. For sure. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you about the cockpit seating here. Oh, well, in the cockpit here, we have uh, uh, bolster seats in this boat, which are um, which are optional. And uh, the bolster seats will allow you to get up above the windshield if you're, uh, if you're needing to get a clear view of your, uh, of your direction. That's great. Mm -hmm. And my favorite place on the bow rider is up front. Let's check it out. Okay. The mark for a 19-footer, uh, I'm a 6-footer. Well, i got plenty of room up here. There's a lot of room in the front of this boat, Alan. How did you manufacture that extra foot? Well, we uh, took a cue off our 208, which is also very roomy in the bow. We knew we needed a lot of width, and uh, we were able to get enough length for a uh, for most average people to be able to sit up in the bow area. That's great. Tell me about the uh, locker. Yeah, up in the bow locker, there's a, a two-step beach boarding ladder from the front, as well as a nice place to uh, store uh, an anchor. That's great. Mm -hmm. It's nice and clean. Yeah. Clean uh, installation there. I love the fact that it's easy to board, too, That's right. from the dock. If you want to do it uh, tug uh, ferry style. Yep. A couple, a couple cup holders up in the front, as well as, as a uh, self bailing cooler. For more information on the Stingray 198LX and other great boats, go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones, and we'll see you out on the water.